Greetings. While in my time it may not have been considered customary for a woman to address an audience unannounced, <laughs> I do not suppose that I have ever been a woman considered to be too terribly tied to custom. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the Baroness. Micaela, Leonardo, Anton, Almanaster y Rojas de Puntaca, <coughs> daughter of the great Spanish visionary architect and entrepreneur Don Andres Almanaster y Rojas, and wife, separated by bed and born from one Celestin, del Frappe, Please forgive me, ladies and gentlemen, if I do not seem a portrait of feminine humility. For me and my great city, pride has often been a matter of survival. Our twisted social constructs have not ever seemed for me a practical possibility. <laughs> yes, it is true. I was named for Saint Michael the Archangel, a warrior with wings who cast Satan himself from heaven. Perhaps my father knew on the day of my birth as he accepted accolades from the crown of Spain and his young wife labored heartily giving birth to his only heir, a girl child with a most pernicious mind. Perhaps Papa knew even then what demons I would encounter along the way. But then who is to say it was not my mother who gave me my name for being born a woman in 1795, an heiress on either side of the great Atlantic divide was sure to find her soul's worth little more than the weight of the silks, satins, and lace that her body bore. 